Here with head coach Sandy Botham following the heartbreaking 75-72 loss at Wright State. Coach, your team sure responded and came out today and, and uh, it's a tough one. Yeah, it was a tough one because I thought we did everything that we needed to do, you know, to get the victory and we just didn't execute down the stretch. You know, they, we had a five-point lead with minutes something and Demings took over and, and we just didn't execute and out of bounds. But, you know, it, it comes down to execution the entire game, as I communicated. It really doesn't come down to the end. Um, but I was proud of our kids. I was proud of how they did respond. They made a game. They competed. Um, they really came in with, with uh, some fortitude, with some toughness, um, and really put themselves in a position to beat a very good Wright State team. So as disappointing as it is to come away with a, with a loss, um, you know, this is a game that we're going to be able to build on, and I think our players understand what they need to do to be successful at this level and in the Horizon League. Uh, come out right away. I think we missed like five of our first six shots, got down 9-0. How proud of you the way the team responded and, and ended up taking that four-point lead, lead at halftime? Yeah, I mean, I just think they showed a lot of mental toughness and, um, and resiliency and, and perseverance and... Um, they just played. They played basketball with a, a competitiveness, and and uh, so it was. I mean, you know, start like that, but but uh, they they grinded it back out, and really, you know, to come be a winning at halftime and winning with three seconds left to go in the game, um, you know, that's in some ways it's a victory, especially if you look back on our last three games and how we finished. So, um, you know, it's a game that. Uh, we're going to learn from and uh, definitely build on. All right, State's Demings gets uh, 38 points, which is actually a season high for the league so far. Of course, none bigger than that three-pointer at the end. Yeah. Kind of take us through your thoughts watching that develop. You know, I think everybody's going to beat themselves up, and myself included. You know, she, she got off a three. That's what great players done. I think Wright State has has won a lot of close ones and they've put the ball in her hands and and she's won it for them so she's done it slashing to the basket she's done it obviously tonight she you know pull does a pull up three she's a competitor and um yeah it's it's it's, it's a tough one this one will i'll be dreaming about this and not sleeping about this game for a long time uh, Gina Swapshaw gets her first start responds with 10 points and nine rebounds and then also Ashley Green today uh, didn't score until there was about five and a half minutes left in the game, but ended up with 11 points. Can you talk about those two freshmen stepping yeah, up? Yeah, I mean, that's, you know, if you look out of the court, we've got three freshmen, a couple sophomores, and a junior playing consistently for us. So, um, you know, Jana really, you know, I thought she had a great game against Detroit, and uh, that's why we gave her the nod. And, and to see her respond like this is, is such a positive for us because that's something that we haven't had. It's just depth coming off the bench. And, uh, you know, and tonight, yeah, obviously she started, but, um, you know, to have that extra, extra punch, you know, in the post spot is really going to be important to us as we continue on the Horizon League. Like I said, at the end, uh, Ashley, 11 points and then took a charge, had a key steal. Um, yeah. Just talk about her composure out there yeah, a little bit. Yeah, you know, Ashley's been, she's been an impact player from the beginning, and, um, you know, we put the ball in her hands, and, um, and uh, you know, and she's done it defensively and offensively, you know. Um, so it's, it's great to see. You know, this is, this is a heartbreaker, but I think we're all going to learn from this game. And, um, but to have players like Ashley and Gianna grow up with this right state game is just going to make us stronger. Thanks for your time, Coach. Thanks.